Hallo oh, meine lieben Freunde, was geht? Willkommen zurück zu einer neuen Folge von Let's Play. Life is strange. Wir sind im Two Whales Diner und müssen jetzt erstmal hier alles regeln. The party is over. This vortex is much bigger. Ja. Yeah. It's so hard to believe people were eating breakfast here. Only a few hours ago. Erstmal hinsetzen. Süßer kleiner Hundi. Er mag uns. Das ist schön. Er mag uns. Please be okay, Chloe. I can't lose you. Das kann ich Pompidou nicht. Ah. Elise Frank still has Pompidou at his side. Es ist super, dass er Pompidou hat. I hate to say I'm glad to see you. But I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. Should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. Can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh yeah. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? Go on. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? I have to go back in time. Jefferson already k killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. I have Sie to do sprechen, something. Ohne die Lippen zu bewegen. Max, wow. going back in time is what caused the storm. All because, because of me? What? How? I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. Oh, what happened with Jefferson? Did, did he hurt you? He used Nathan to get drugs and money for him. Warum redet sie nicht? Also, warum bewegt sie den Mund nicht? Max, I'm so sorry you had to go through all that. You're the bravest person I've ever known. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Dead. History. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Even in the environment. 
all this destruction is my fault? Give me a break. You sure the hell didn't give yourself time travel powers? I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole. You're part of something bigger. I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. How could there be a more important moment in history? And I'm in the middle of it with you? So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. Okay, das gucken wir uns gleich an. Erstmal will ich hier noch mit on, den anderen Leuten Charles. reden. Focus on the people here. Come on, Max. Let's talk over here and give Frank some rest and space. <coughs> Joyce, how are you doing? Just when I think I've already been through the ringer. Where's Chloe? I... I'll find her. Not in this storm, you won't. And you're not going out there, Max. I just have to pray that Chloe and David are holed up someplace safe. I'm sorry about all this, Joyce. Don't be, honey. It's not like you whipped up this tornado on your own. Um, I mean, I'm also sorry about everything with David. You don't have control over any of that. David is an adult, and he has a lot more age and experience under his belt. And if he doesn't always show it. Well, I didn't mean to take David's side against you or Chloe. I know you try to see the good side in everybody, and David needs to try that too, but that's not important now. I just want our lives to be normal again. With all the shit going on this week, I think you're right. And look at me, trying to keep my family together. Again. Joyce, you've gone through so much for Chloe and David. If you were my mom, I would be so proud. Oh, sweetie, thank you. But your parents should be prouder of you. Even David told me how tough he thinks you are. And he doesn't hmm. give out many compliments, as you know. It's nice. David is a real hero. Spieler! I don't know what he's gone Mund through. Before, what? But I can imagine. And he even showed me how to find my own strength under extreme conditions. I am so glad to hear you say that, Max. I know he's not always an easy person to defend. Most people only see him at his worst. You've seen him at his best. And that's the man I want in my life. Okay. Please be okay. Okay, Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, it makes two of us. Now, if only I had Rachel back. Now, Max, what about that info I gave you? Did you and Chloe find out what happened to her? Oh, Frank. I don't know how to say this, so... I just will. Rachel is dead. God, no, please. Please, no, no, not Rachel. She can't fucking be. Are you, are you, are you sure? I mean, how do you know? We used the names you gave us to track down a farmhouse. My... Professor Mark Jefferson has this creepy photo torture room and we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students Prescott Fuck fuck I knew it. I should never have hooked up with that sick punk Papadou hated him yeah. You saw you saw Rachel Yes I wish I didn't. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson, and he... he killed her. How? Hmm. How did he kill her? He used some drug and 
gave her an overdose. An overdose? The only way Nathan could have done that is, is if I sold it to him. I killed my lioness. No, what have I done? Where is this motherfucker Jefferson? He's dead. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel, oh God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me, just, just not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. Well, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. No, oh, Frank tut mir so leid, ey. Frank tut mir richtig, richtig leid. Good job, Warren. I hope those supplies are enough. This is not where I want to die. Alles klar, Leute. Dann back in time, würde ich sagen. Hey. Be careful out there. For luck. Just in case we don't get out of this, I wanted to say... I know, Warren. Of course you do. I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. Oh mein Gott. Oh, das ging schnell. <lacht> We got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. <lacht> Chloe. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna sorry, find Warren. Connected to Rachel. Let's go now. Chloe, wait, listen. I can walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to. You're gonna die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time, and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me down. You're right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you and others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. We saw the proof. Now, excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Nathan is dead and you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Jefferson kidnapped Rachel and some other girls. He was also manipulating Nathan and he killed him. Then it's Jefferson's turn to die now. I understand why you don't want to do this and I won't blame you for not coming with me. You almost had her, Max. 
I can still do this. Excuse me, I'm going to that park. Nathan is that fucker. Okay. Dann würde ich mal sagen. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? I, I was able to go back in time to the last day William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely paralyzed. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you... You asked me to... End your life. I did. For you. I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and I never want to hurt you, ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's, that's why you should come with me, so we can stay together and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? Is that why you stuck up for him? Because you think he can help us, really? Chloe, no matter how much of a douche he's been, David truly cares about you. <sighs> Please. Like he cared when he got in your face for smoking a joint? You should have seen his reaction when I told him that Jefferson killed you. He was crushed. Are you serious? I... I can't see him showing any feeling. Except towards my mom. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been through so much. I... I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Yes, you are. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Alter Vater. Voll gegen das Mikro gehauen, ey. I 
see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. I'm nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure, but not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. And for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that, too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You, you remember, right? Well, we, we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. It's coming closer. Oh, I, I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on it. Oh God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on. Chloe. I've got your back. Alfred Hitchcock famously what? calls film little pieces of time. I'm back in class. As what the films. hell? These pieces of time can frame us in our glory. I have to listen sorrow, to this Jefferson lecture again. To shadow, this might be hell. <laughs> now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is messed the condition in black and white? Am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Bueller. Uh, Diane Arbus. Be calm and there you go, don't Victoria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunt. What is this? <lacht> Alles klar, Leute. Wir beenden jetzt erstmal den Part. Ich hoffe, es hat euch gefallen. Wenn ja, bewertet den Part. Alter, Vater, was ist das? What? Okay. Ja, wir sehen uns bei das. Das war übersteuert, es tut mir leid. Wir sehen uns bei das nächste Mal wieder. Haut da rein.